at the flea market. You never know what you're gonna find. Hopefully not fleas. You kids looking for anything in particular? Knives. A really loud musical instrument would be nice. Hatchets. Maybe something of the plastic horse variety? Nunchucks. And what about you, Bob? Well, I'll be looking for old cast iron pants. To use as a weapon? For cooking, but as a weapon, I guess, if it came to it. Like if you had to fend off a hamburglar? Maybe. Just be careful, Dad. Thank you, Tina. Okay, kids, here's a couple of bucks each. Go nuts! Or buy some nuts. Other people's used nuts. Hey, Gail. Lena, is it dangerous to eat a tangerine with a carrot? They're both orange. It's fine. I've done it many a time. Okay, bye. Oh, that was Gail. Did she want to know if it was okay to combine something with something else? Yeah, orange foods. It's okay, right? What are all these small pictures of baseball players? They don't look that athletic, but they are holding bats. Is this guy smoking? Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that sweater. Oh, look at that rug. Oh, look at the painting. Sunset. Is it a good painting, Bob? I can't tell. Me neither. How do you tell if a painting is good? I don't know. Shapes? Lynn, I just don't know if we need a steamer trunk full of old TV guys. Oh, my God. The wheelie frickin' mammoth. Bob, it's the Willy frickin' Mammoth. I know. It found us! How did it find us? Why did it find us? We got rid of it. Are we cursed? It's not our fault! The kids completely stopped playing with us. It was way too big for our apartment. Way too big! It's not like we planned on getting rid of our kids' huge toys. It just happened. Yeah, the truck was just, it was there. And the kids were at school. They didn't play with it anymore. <laughs> and we thought they would just kind of forget about it. We were sure they'd forget. But then they didn't. Oh, hey, Mom, Dad, have you guys seen the Wheelie Mammoth anywhere? We want to jump off the fire escape and land on him. Um, first of all, don't jump off the fire escape. Isn't that what fire escapes are for? That's what fire escapes are for, Dad. Yeah, it's safe. Uh, no. Secondly, uh, we thought you guys didn't really play with Willy Mammoth anymore, so, um, we donated it. You what? what? You got rid of the sticks, Belcher? Uh, yeah. Months ago. And, uh, you're only noticing now, I might add. How could you? Is your heart made of stone? Well, we donated it to a, a special place. That'll make you guys is not mad at us. Um, somewhere Wheelie could live a better life. To a uh, roller rink. Uh, yeah, because it's got wheels. The roller rink in town? Uh, no, no. A different town. Still kind of mad here, people. Trying not to lose my cool. Why would you do that? Uh, because these aren't just, uh, regular kids. They're, um... Orphans! Yep. They're orphans. Yep, sad little orphans with soot-covered faces. And the only joy in their lives is getting out on the rink with that mammoth. Hmm. Yeah, and we've been wanting to tell you guys, but we were waiting for... Uh, a signed thank you card from all the orphans. I don't know what's taking them so long. Uh, maybe they're busy with orphan stuff. Scrubbing floors and stairs. Hiding in laundry baskets, singing about tomorrow. Huh, and you guys are for real right now. Promise. Absolutely. Well, I guess Willie is probably having a better life at that rink than it was here. And doing more good. It tripped me a lot. Like, a lot. If you'll excuse me, I'm going to my room to write a tribute song about Wheelie. I'm thinking of calling it Rolling Down the River, if that's not taken. Or Dream On, if it is. But now the best is here. I'm freaking out. What do we do? Do we, do we tell the kids the truth? About how we didn't tell them the truth before? Are you nuts? They never look at us the same way again. It'll be all right. My parents lied to me and Gail all the time. Uh-huh. But Gail turned out to be Gail. We cannot let the kids see this. Okay, let's think. What, what, what are our options? Besides telling the truth? Oh, yeah, besides that. This pal Palomino is now a Palomino. <laughs> hey guys, I'm gonna go show mom and dad my new horse and probably say that Palomino Palomino thing again to them. Yeah, you definitely should. You're gonna love my room. It smells pretty okay most of the time. You're used to a barn, so you should be fine with it. Okay, the kids haven't seen it, so we're fine. We just need to gather them up, go home before they, oh my God, there's Tina! No crap, oh crap, oh crap.